Okay, I'm going to do a video today and talk about how to set up the Ethernet settings on this thing and the communication. So the first thing you want to do is you want to be in Supervisor, and if you are, you go to Setup, which is F5. You go to Properties, F4, and you go to Ethernet, F5. And what you have here is you have your local and your remote. So what you want to do is the remote is whatever is talking to this thing. PLC, a computer, our software, whatever. Your local is this guy. And so you want to set whatever your remote is, you want to move the, if this is the remote's 100, then your local's 101. You want those to be one apart. And so that's how you set up your, you know, your physical piece. I'm going to hit the page down and go to protocol. And the protocol we have, we have extended or bi-directional. And extended means you send a command, it responds back, hey, I got the command, and acknowledge. And then you can also set the type to client or server, or disabled. And depending on what your device is, typically this is gonna be a client. This is not gonna serve data, this is gonna receive data. And so once you do that, then you would use the, the commands like the V command for a variable, you would send that V command down and you would update a variable. Or if you sent a P command, you would load a pattern. And uh, those commands can be found in another video. Thanks.